Hello, and welcome along to Adobe After Effects with your host, Robert Smith. In this video, we're going to show um, how to output as a QuickTime movie. Now, normally we output as a .mp4 file, but if we want higher quality, uh, we're going to use the QuickTime format. So here I am in After Effects. I've got a comp, and it's exactly 30 seconds long, which is what I want. Um, this, is, this could be used for a grad show. So to do that, I'm going to go to Composition, Add to Render Queue this time, not use the uh, Adobe Media Encoder like we normally do. I'm going to add to the Render Queue. And down here, actually I've already got one, so I'll just delete that. We've got three things we have to look at. First thing is Best Settings. Click on that. And just leave everything as default usually. The only thing to check is this time span, the work area only. But if your um, timeline is 30 seconds long, that'll be fine. So leave that as is. And OK. The next one down is where we'll do all the work. If we click on Output Module, you'll see up here it defaults to QuickTime. And that's what we want. We want to make a QuickTime movie or a .mov movie. Now the Format Options over here, if I click on that, we have lots and lots of things called codecs, but we're not going to go there. We're just going to leave it on animation. Make sure that's on animation, which is probably uh, no compression at all. So it's going to make a monster file, but OK that. And the sound, leave it on 48 kilohertz. That's fine. And OK. Now one more thing to do is to click over here. Output to, where do we want to put it? Let's put it on the desktop. And we'll call it my movie, whatever we want to call it. And we'll have the extension .mov, which is what we want it to be. So I'll click Save, like that. And now I'm ready to render. To do that, over here you'll see a little button called Render. If I just click on this, away it goes. Now you'll notice it's pretty quick. The reason being it doesn't have to compress anything. They're basically raw files. So it's going to be top quality. But again, the file size will be about or one gig. If it was an MP4, it'd be about 50 meg. So you can see it's a monster file. But at 30 seconds or 35 seconds, whatever, it's about 1 to 1.2 gig. Which again, a monster file, but very, very high, high quality. OK, if we look on the desktop here, we should that up somewhere. My messy desktop, there it is there. Just double click on it. And away it goes. And there's my movie. And it's as high quality as you can actually get coming out of After Effects. And that's it. So if you're doing the graduation show at the Design Center at Enmore, um, that's how we want you to output your movie for projection. Okay, thanks for watching.